what surprised me the most being at the World Economic Forum is that trust in traditional corporations and brands is at an all-time low. So I think that's, a, that's interesting because it, it starts to make you think about what, what's the meaning of trust, you know, what are the elements of trust, especially in how they have evolved in business over the decades. What uh, inspired me the most uh, is the fact that uh, people are claiming now that the traditional uh, corporations were not designed for trust in the digital age. Traditionally, in the past, trust used to flow uh, vertically, uh, just mimicking the structures of, of power, you know, and control. And today, trust is actually distributed. Um, so an example, a, a very simple example is uh, Airbnb, right? What we're trusting with Airbnb is the connection between strangers, right? We are trusting the fact that we can stay at a stranger's home and that everything is going to work out. I think the big insight, uh, especially when it comes down to, you know, what do companies need to do to regain the trust, you know, that has eroded over, over the years, is to focus on the why they do things. Um, the transparency about, you know, what they do is, is not sufficient because, in fact, technology is empowering customers to figure out, you know, what they do. I think the whole holy grail of building trust is really aligning, you know, the your interests with those of your client, you know, and, and that, that goes into the issue of the why, you know, why you're doing it.